on the legend of Grimrock. What is the situation? The situation is that we want to get some brass keys. We need to get brass keys, four brass keys, because there is a wall not far from here that um, contains four brass blocks. So we need to get four brass keys. And this place we're in at the moment has got them. Well, it's got teleporters that will provide um, the keys. Basically, in the hall behind us, is a scenario being played out with some super enemies. So it's quite a difficult place. I mean the ones we're fighting at the moment are standard enemies. They're nothing to write home about. They're okay. They're not exactly a huge problem for our team. These are just infantry. The ones we're gonna be facing are a bit tougher. A bit tougher. Right, we can afford to give our team a bit of a rest here. Um, we're going to go into this um, place where the teleporters uh, can be initiated, they're hidden. When you first go in there, the teleporters are hidden. So, um, blimey. So these towers of super monsters, so to speak, are Oh yeah, look, this is where one of the teleporters In each corner, there's a um, facility for a teleporter, but if you explore the pit or the basement area, you'll see they've got all these uh, super enemies, um, which you can easily release. Um, each one has got a pressure plate underneath it. There's a pressure plate here, which is covered in dirt. Um, you end up coming to this place, which is all in. About that git, it is a bloody pain that one. Um, hmm. Okay, we can actually try a freeze bomb on him, I suppose. Yeah, a bit of a freeze bomb on the sod. It's quite dangerous, actually, to be honest. see the back of him. Um, she is going to go up on... Oh, she's on heavy armour now. She is now on heavy armour because what happens is you do get an opportunity to grab some heavy armour in the game. Um, oh, he's got loads of food, look. Got tons of it. Uh, there's a mine key right here which could come in handy. So, what about an armband or some description? Oh, they've all got armbands already, look. Don't need it. Um, so which way do you want to go? If you go this way, there are various goodies to... So there you go, she's just picked up strength plus one. There's a red gem there, look. A red gem. Right, oh, where did these come from? Blimey, there's more enemies. Amazing. Crack 
of it are absolutely flipping tons of them. Where they all come from? Where the smeg do they all actually all come from? This is crazy. So if you want to, you can actually go back on your old roots. Where does this go up to? This goes up to nowhere special, so you can use it to give the team a bit of a rest. Um, I think we did some foraging in here, so I don't think there's anything left. But it's just that you can go back. Nice and fresh to take on some of these varmints. You know, I'll let them come in here, have they? Because you can actually lock them out if you want to. I think it would be a mistake to waste any bombs on fighting. Oh, blimey, hello, where did that one come from? Where? What is going on here? Wow. I do not know. Uh, right. <laughs> Let us go. What is going on? Um, so, we will do another rest and I'll tell you what, this is probably the moment to save the game. End of spiral. Right, so the thing to do now is to get things moving because what we want to do. Um, what we want to do oh, is to get the teleporters working. Like, hello. Oh my god. Um, right, so any minute now, these teleporters should. Hello. Toad has taken the flipping Minotaur's weapon. So all the bloody teleporters have now come on too bloody late. So where does this go? So that is so annoying. So here's brass key number one. In the meantime, a Minotaur. Oh, he's got a backup weapon! He's got a backup weapon! Oh, I'm so chuffed we got that backup weapon. So he's got the, the weapon we got nicked by that horrible toad. I was really cheesed off about that but we've got a backup weapon anyway which is why you always need to so that's six to nineteen what, what's this one that's quite a lot over but I mean if you always have a weapon ready to go in case anything like that happens so now we've got two keys we've got a mine key and we've got a brass key we need another three brass keys so we have been here before um, this was like a one-off area before this is quite a dangerous place to come. This is the first deep water puzzle area. Oh, oh, oh. Madam, where are we going? Uh, so just keep an eye on the map because you can actually lose team members here quite easily. There's no harm in checking a few of these to see if there's anything worth having. But don't spend too long. So as you can see, we've got a magic bridge, we are in real trouble. We lost somebody already, we lost, we lost um, Tiggy. But yeah, we got one of these back, so maybe we can give him... So the only one that's down on his luck is the Minotaur, so we did really well there. So that's number one brass key. Actually, we have actually come back to the area where the brass locks are. We are going through this food, strangely enough. Um, actually, just in case you don't know where the four brass locks are, they're just around the corner. Four brass locks, I'll just show you where they are because they lead to an entirely different mission. Quite worth doing. So, here are the four. Oh, hello. God, I'm so glad that mine is all a backup weapon. Flipping brilliant. Because otherwise you'd have to take, go down and hunt that bloody toad down. Which is no flipping easy job. Right, here are the four brass locks. One, two, three, four. And we've got one brass key already. So he's going to go up on... What? Um, 
it's quite a difficult one, isn't it? I quite like the idea of getting him skilled up on alchemy, to be honest, because should the Ratmaster go for a Burton, um, you have got... We haven't got a bow, have we? Missed out somewhere on that. Oh, I know where it was, too. Yeah. Got a crossbow. We've only got one arrow for it. Charming. So, there's only one way out of here. There's a rock. Um, let's have a little look around because down here is where the food store is. This is where we got the food. Right, so the food is along that path there. In fact, it's all still open, look. This is still open from the last time. So if you go up here, I don't think there's any food left because we nicked it all. Mind you, there's that left. Didn't pick that up the last time, did we? So that's something straight away. Um, there's no food left up here. This is where you come for your food. There's this thing. Orb of Wilson. Which uh, comes from a film, actually. There's a movie where a bloke gets... Uh, Anyway, I expect you know all that, so that's that. Um, we are going to go on to get back to that area to get the second brass key. Cause basically, you've got to go on all the four. Oh, look, we're back here. Let's see if there's anything left on those shelves. No, there isn't. So that's alright. This place has gone bonkers, look. This place is going to be bonkers. Um, oh, there's the there's the teleporter that we just used. I'm pretty sure that was the one. So we'll see if the exit doors open up actually, because there's actually an exit door. I mean, you can do these teleporters in any order that you want, but um, I like to do them. This, this one seems to be the next one to do. Sweet! So, Minotaur, what are you going to go up on Lado? He's on armour already. What about... Yeah, go on. What about this Kidio? Oh, yeah. He can, he's light armour now. Have we got any light armour? Because I know we left a whole load of stuff back at the Blue Stones. There's light armour galore! Look at this lot! There's tons of it! Which he is now qualified for. So... Are we... Oh, more! More, more, more. Um, this fella needs some food, Minotaur. Oh, Minotaur's got another sack. Right, everyone's looking happy. So he can wear the special light armour helmet. Um, so wear that, which he's qualified for. Oh look, he's completely suited out in light armour now because he's just gone up. Right, um, we're getting low on those red ones, aren't we? Golden Bennett we are. Um, okay, I think we're okay. But, we've got some leftover clothing. We don't seem to need, need it, to be honest. We'll just leave it here, I think. Um, so we could do a bit of a sleep. Basically there's another brass key to be found somewhere in this mission because that's why we've been sent it. So let's have a little look. Where? What does all this mean? There's the exit there. Let's do another save. You can, I think every time you get to a critical situation like that, just do another save. It can't hurt. Uh, it is the times that you don't do a save. That you end up going back about half an hour. What's on this one? It's a rope! For God's sake! There's a rope there! Wow! Ha ha ha! That's absolutely superb! We haven't got a rope! 
Well, I tell you what, what a find. That, I mean, that is great, isn't it? You don't need to flip and get injured on dropping down. There's a flipping scroll there. Um, okay, we'll have a look. Scroll of Fireball. Okay. I think I know the scroll of Fireball. There's a skull there, look. So, we still haven't picked up the second brass key, so where... Oh, I know where it is. I think you find it now on the flipping tomb, don't you? Drop down to... Where is it we go then? Um, because... The whole idea is, of this is that we get another key out of this. So, where is the next key? I've got a feeling this goes up to the tomb. And you've got to fight your way through. Yeah, this is this is where the second key comes in. Um, so we are just about to get the second key, but it's not easy. So you've got to really concentrate and maybe go back to this. This is uh, going up to the advanced two. This is it. Going up to the advanced two. Do you know what? I'm not sure. Um, Is it then? I don't know. Maybe I'm barking up the wrong tree. I don't know. If you take any of that stuff, ooh, more of these to pick up. Didn't pick them up the last time. Ah, I was right. I was right. If you look up the top here, look, see that magic bridge? We've done a really good route. We have done a really good route. This is a really quick way of getting that brass key. Look. God, what a fabulous turnout for the books. Here it is. How easy is that? We've now got two brass keys. That was superb. That was absolutely brilliant. That was, that was really easy. How easy could that be? So we've got two brass keys out of four. There's our friendly neighbourhood wyvern. You can fight him if you want to. Or you can just shuffle around. Where the hell are we now? What the heck is this? Oh, right. Okay. Oh, this goes back to the war zone. This goes back to the war zone. Look, here we are. Back to the uh, the rest of the other teleporters. But what you could do is, instead of just going straight back to the fray, because we're near to the blue stones now, let's just have a little look on the map. Let's go back to the blue stones and do a little bit of housekeeping because <sighs> we've got all this stuff. Um, so, she's light armoured up to the hilt, so is he. Uh, yeah, everybody is. There's nothing. There's nothing there that we need to worry about. Um, basically, we haven't got a bow, unfortunately. It's the one thing we didn't get, because it didn't uh, turn out right. We've got loads of these weapons we're never going to flip in need. We're never going to need this now, I don't think. this. I mean, keep them for definite and get the rat master to shuffle a few po poison ones definitely um, and oh that's it we've got no more of those um, we're getting low on those red ones aren't we um, okay so it's back on the stones actually we're getting quite low on stones anyway uh, he has got some other weapons that he could use but um, <coughs> Crossbow? What is the point of a crossbow when you've got one quarrel? That isn't going to work, is it? Got one quarrel there, look. Um, this thing is quite good for the back, actually. We got the rope! We've got the rope! That is such a good result. Um, she is on light weapons two. This is a light weapons three weapon. That's great to have. That's another um, light armor one, which isn't particularly marvelous. We have got, I'll tell you what, we could add that sack, can we, for the keys. Let's have that sack for the keys. We've got a mine key, we've got two brass keys, we need another two. Um, this, we haven't got a firearm, have we? So... What? 
What? What the smeg was that? What the hell was that, for God's sake? <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. That's pretty amazing. Um, that's a shield. I don't think we need a shield, do we? Wait a minute, what's he got in his hand, then? Oh, he's got a shield in his hand. Um, right. Let's have a little look what needs to be stowed. This is quite good. I quite like this horn. Where is he? Oh, there he is, look. That's a lovely old blast of the horn, that is. Um, don't need this, really. So, um, wait a minute. You can have that shield on there. Right. So let's get restored. And we can get back to the battle zone. Which is just here. We want to get those other keys. Um, if you want to, you can actually use these buttons to control the trapdoor and the gate. There's actually a gate there, look, I'll show you. So you can close it or open it. I'd leave it open, personally. But anyway, we... Oh. Well, let's take him on. Let's take him on. Like it. That's not bad. Wait a minute, have we got any of those? Oh we have, let's use these bloody things on these creatures. I don't know why it is. No, I mean it went out straight away. Though. There are some right old things happening here. Um we've got another two teleporters to deal with. Um, there's another one here. I suppose we could just jump, drop straight into it from there. Oh, where the hell is this? Where the hell is this? Right, uh, the best thing to do on that scenario up above is to remember or mark the teleport. Ah, here we are, look. Third brass key out of four. So now we've got three or four brass keys. Just need one more. We are there, brother. Um, obviously, if you're in a situation like this beach, have a little scout around to see if anything sort to pick up. Well, we just saw the brass key, of course. Um, what else? Is there anything else? I don't know, food. Oh, look, there is, look. So, do a bit. Oh, very well. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, they're all over the place. Look. You only have to look and you shall see. Or is that it? Um, no, I don't think there's all that. There's not that many of them. Keep an eye out, though. Oh, this is absolutely marvellous, isn't it? God, we've got quite a few of them. Brilliant. Um, ooh, more. Brilliant. We tell you what, we are a bit short of them. So this is quite welcome, this. Oh yeah, there's tons of them, look. They're all growing at the edge of the mangroves. Flipping heck, there's tons. Very welcome too. Right, Ratmaster, your duty needs to be done. I suppose you could get the, um, the sorcerer. Oh look, I tell you what, we could have one of those, couldn't we? Oh, I tell you what, two each, no problem. Two each. These are so good if you've got these in the game. Um, never turn them down. They're absolutely like oil in the gears of war. So the team are well on their way to getting the full set of brass keys. That'll do for now. Um, wait a minute. What is there? Anything down this way? What the heck? We got a. We got. We got a bow. We got a bow. Where's all those arrows? Oh no! I think we stowed them at the bloody blue stones. After all that, <sighs> that is incredible. What a mistake! 
what? Wait, tell you, we're going through this food like now tomorrow. I thought we had tons of it. Um, Blimey's getting low. She's getting even lower. Oh my god, we, we stowed all those bow, uh, those arrows, and now we found... Oh, there's more food. Vicar. There is more food by the look of it. Um, yeah, there's food there, look. Oh, we're all right. We're doing well. It's well worth coming down here, look. Oh, there's food in all directions, look. This one is a bit difficult to pick up. I mean, it's like a treasure trove of stuff, isn't it? Oh, we've got these as well. These as well. Right, so we have done so well. Oh, where the hell are we? We're back at the blue stones. Where is right? Where are our arrows? We have done it for a crook horn longbow. Oh yes, thanking you. That is top dollar. Bloody hell! Now we are. What a game! What a game! Absolutely brilliant. So we didn't get the um, the standard bow from earlier on, but we did. How many? Is there any more gates open down here? No. Um, what's this up here then? Oh, oh it's the Ethrals, isn't it? This is the Ethrals place. Yeah. I tell you what, we missed out on those ethereal daggers, didn't we? So, hmm. There's, there's three or four ethereals up in that forest there. So, we will go and see if we can get the um, final brass key of the set. Um, which is obviously down this way. There's one teleporter left to go. And then we've got the whole four four keys, which is the one we didn't do. I think it's this one down here. Oh my goodness, it is this one, isn't it? Oh, there's the key there! There is the final key. Gold hello. Now we've got all four keys. There you go, hello. Um... Don't need any of this stuff, to be honest. Don't think so, anyway. Um, oh my god, that's so dangerous. Right, we've got all four keys. Uh, you can hang around up there. I mean, I think there's a secret um, door up there as well. I'm not too sure, but here are the four locks. So... She's got the um, sack for the keys. Another one there. So now we are in business. The gate is opened, and we've got another deep water puzzle area to consider. I'll tell you one thing though this um, head here is a little tip because if you drop down exactly there, then you get some good loot, I believe. Um, Let's do a save. Right, so another thing is, in here you've got Zarktons. So if you've got a whole pile of sparkler bombs, we've got nine, look. Um, just for the day, I think we should just change it slightly, just for this little episode. Because if you haven't got sparkler bombs, it's very difficult to fight those Arctons. So we just drop down, we don't really need that to be honest. Um, oh, that is for our, yeah, that's definitely for her. Oh, scroll of darkness. Oh, that doesn't sound too, oh, what's this? More arrows. Well, that is a fantastic dagger for that girl on the front there. Right, so now you've got these little characters and you need these, these things really to take them down. Um, what else? Oh, well, no. Yeah, we, we need to have one of those blue ones around the ready because you're going to die. You are going to die. So, we've got some fantastic light armour. That is absolutely superb. That is the top light armour you can get. Right, now you need to put the blue one on. Oh, you need to just place something in there. And then when you look down, this thing is energised. So you can actually guess that's a spare blue one. Um, we 
already got those, got that. So that takes you down to there. So now, see, this is where you need those sparkler bombs. He went in one go. Oh, there's more of them, look. Oh, I didn't realise it'd just go in one go. Right, but you need to... Oh, blimey, hello. Right, take it back to there. So, now, what happens when you go up the top here now? Ah, now you can go across to this one. Always welcome another sack. Uh, let's talk gear. There's a fantastic weapon for the Minotaur there. And another weapon for the Minotaur there. You got this thing. So now you can say, I'm out of here because, oh, bloody hell, it's so dodgy, isn't it? So now when you get to the top, you're out of the water. Could you have got more loot? I don't know. But you've got a fantastic shield there. That is definitely way better than that one. Um, you can bring this fella back using one of these things. Look, there's tons of them. So, he's back. Good. Um, we've done pretty well out of that. Um, you can go back on to the bow because the Zarktons are no longer around. You definitely need to have some of those sparkler bombs otherwise. It's got the flipping flail which is a heavy weapon 3 and he is up on heavy weapon 2 so he's nearly there. This is a heavy weapon 3 as well, so we have really scored big time. This is the top light armour that you can get. Um, let's have a look, what about her? Um, yeah, she can go up, definitely, on this one. This definitely tops that other one. Um, he hasn't got light armour, this is way better than that, but I mean we can keep that for him. Um, he's going to go up on light armour at some stage. This is just rubbish. Um, we've done pretty well on that little mission there, and there is more to come as well. So, the arrows go there. I mean, this just goes on and on. So, what else can we get out of this? I mean, you could go back down and find some more stuff, because there's a ladder that goes right from the ground floor right through to the top. That's not bad, is it? That's not bad at all. Um, Oh, we've got another couple of blues there anyway. Um, let's have a look. We've got that thing out of it. We've already got one. Um, so, save it again and see what happens next. Because the exit from here, I think, could be a bit dodgy. So that's why I'm saving it. But I've got a feeling there's actually a secret door or something over this other side. Let's just check it out. Is there anything over here? Oh my god, look, it's a nightmare. Anyway, that's probably good enough to show you the four brass keys. Thank you.